हेलो माय फ्रेंड्स यू आर वेलकम इन दिस इंग्लिश यूट्यूब क्लास टुडे वी विल रीड अबाउट द मॉडल शुड और आउट द यूज ऑफ शुड और आउट व्हेन वी यूज शुड एंड आउट शुड और आउट इज यूज्ड फॉर मॉरल ऑब्लिगेशन देयर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ ऑब्लिगेशन वन इज द लीगल ऑब्लिगेशन and second one is the moral obligation legal obligation means anything that we do as the rule as a law that is the legal obligation or in legal obligation we use must legal obligation mein hum must ka use karte hain but in a moral obligation moral obligation means anything any action that we do as a morality morality means as a human being as a human creature what we do that is the moral obligation moral obligation is not compulsory moral obligation is not mandatory legal obligation is compulsory and mandatory but moral obligation is not compulsory essential or a mandatory we should do as a human being that is the moral obligation like we should touch the feet of our parents we should respect the elders the poor should help the the rich should help the poor we should plant the trees we should keep the discipline these are the moral obligation moral obligation means as a human being we should do we yeah everyone should speak the truth everyone should speak the truth this is the moral obligation in moral obligation we use should or ought to there is no difference between should and ought to in moral obligation we use should or ought to you may you should or ought to there is no difference between should or ought to moral obligation moral duty one is the legal duty legal duty we have to do as an employee as a worker as a worker we do legal duty or in return we get salary that is the legal duty that is compulsory uh, if we don't do we will we shall be punished punished and moral duty moral duty means as a human being we should do we should speak truth everyone should speak truth this we should plant trees these are the moral duty and in moral duty we use should or in legal duty we use must suggestion or advice suggestion and advice suggestion and advice suggestion is the given instruction that we should do there is also an order in order we use must order is the compulsion that you have to do that is compulsory and mandatory and in advice in suggestion it is up to us that we do or not in suggestion and advice if someone gives suggestion or advice it is up to us that we should follow or not suggestion and advice we use should like you should improve your handwriting you should come in dress you should choose the one subject you should take the light food you are tired so you get rest you should get rest in all these things these there is the advice advice is different from the order in order there is the compulsion there is the mandatory but in advice in suggestion there is no compulsion there is no mandatoriness it is up to us we should do or not that is the advice and suggestion 
mostly should and ought to there is different from must they are totally little bit different where the must shows the compulsion mandatoriness forcefulness strictness must so must प्रदर्शित करता है strictness compulsion mandatoriness essentiality why should and ought to model should and ought to shows softness kindness softness kindness looseness these are the contrast with this is the contrast between should and must and the meaning hindi translation are both chahiye must means chahiye and should and ought to means chahiye there is no difference but must shows compulsion must shows essentially the strictness and should ought to shows softness kindness there are some examples we should respect the parents this is the moral obligation moral duty we should respect the elders we we should respect the parents we should respect the parent parents it means it is up to us we should respect or not we must respect the parents means we have to respect compulsorily hame anivarya roop se karna padega should means it is up to us it is a process that we should respect or not because this is the moral obligation in moral obligation we use should the students should obey the teachers students should obey the teachers should obey means that it is up to the students they obey or not the teachers ye teach स्टूडेंट्स बड़े कि आज्ञाओं का पालन करे या न करे बिकॉज शुड इज नॉट एन ऑर्डर शुड इज नॉट द लीगल ड्यूटी शुड इज द मॉरल ड्यूटी स्टूडेंट शुड ऑबे द टीचर इट इज ए मॉरल ड्यूटी दे शुड फॉलो द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ द महात्मा दे शुड फॉलो उन्हें फॉलो करना चाहिए उन्हें पालन करना चाहिए द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ द महात्मा महात्मा के निर्देशों का महात्मा के निर्देशों को उन्हें पालन करना दिस इज मोरल ड्यूटी मोरल ऑब्लिगेशन दैट दे शुड डू इट इज अप टू देम दैट दे शुड फॉलो और नॉट दिस इज द एडवाइस सजेशन यू शुड टेक द लाइट फूड यू शुड टेक द लाइट यू शुड टेक लाइट फूड तुम्हें हल्का भोजन लेना चाहिए दिस इज द एडवाइस you must take light food you must take light food it means it is an order you should take light food it means it is suggestion you should take rest you are tired you should take rest it is also an advice so friends there is different difference between should and must should ought to and must should shows softness kindness while the must shows strictness obligation force thank you the next model is wood use of wood wood is used for formal request for formal request we use wood for the most polite request we use could i have in previous video told that is the use of could in the most polite request like could you please help me could you please give me 10000 rupees could you please grant me leave for two days could is the most polite request and in a formal request we use would like would you please tell me would you please tell the way of the school 
would you please tell me the price would you please show me the shoes would you sir bring a glass of water would you give me some help would you like to take coffee would you like to take a cup of tea would is the formal request it is not the polite request in formal request we use would there are some examples would you like would you like to take coffee would you like to take coffee it is the request a formal request the speaker asks the listener if you like you can take and if you don't like it doesn't matter this is this means that it is up to the listener that he should take or not request would you like would you like to take coffee kya tumhe coffee pasand hai it means you may take or you may not take it is not the polite request would you tell me the price sir would you tell me the price sir kya tum mujhe kimate bataoge this is also a formal request it is the request to a shopkeeper it is not the polite request she asks he someone is asking for price kimat puch raha hai so it is not a the polite request in polite request we use could would you guide me would you guide me sir would you guide me sir kya tum mujhe guide karoge this is the form of request would you bring the glass of water waiter waiter it is the request to waiter because waiter is for the helping so if any request we do to waiter and shopkeeper we use would would you bring a glass of water waiter so all these are the formal request in formal request we use would thank you next use of would the would or used to would or used to used for the past habit would and used to used for a past habit past habit means bhoot kal ki aadat anything we do as a habit in the past jo kuch bhi hum past mein habit ke roop mein aadat ke roop mein karte the that is the past habit and in past habit anything we do as a past habit we use would or used to he would smoke cigarette he would smoke cigarette in his childhood he would smoke cigarette would smoke in it it is his habit ye uski aadat thi it is it was his habit ye uski aadat thi to smoke in his childhood apne bachpan mein dhumar pan karne ki so would is used we also used to use to he used to smoke he used to smoke he would smoke there is no difference he would smoke he used to smoke cigarette in his childhood i would love film music i would love film music i would love film music in young age young age mein main film music pasand karta tha i would love film music in young age i used to love used to love and would love there is no difference both tell the past habit my grandpa would sit on the hill top my grandpa would sit my grandpa would sit would sit means used to sit it is my grandpa's habit past habit my grandpa would sit on the hill top mere dada ji paadi par baithte the this is the past habit we used to sleep late at night this is also the past habit we used to sleep yeah we, we would sleep we would sleep late at night would sleep means it is the past habit she would get up early in the morning this is also the habit she would get up she would get up go out iti jaldi she would get up early in the morning so these are the past habit in the past habit we use would every used to